Hi everyone, Leti here with this beautiful place, Taro. How is everybody doing today? If this is your first time here, welcome, welcome. Today's reading is going to be How Do Men View You? I am going to separate the energy. It will be men in your family, co-workers, community, others, ops, friends, and then we do have a love or crush. Okay, so the two um, piles to choose from are going to be Jade and Black Obsidian. I'm not going to do three piles for this one. Go ahead, breathe in, breathe out, and let's get started. If you want to be a Patreon member, go ahead and join. The links will be down below. I am closed until May the 1st for personal readings. I am also going to do my Etsy shop on May the 1st, so be looking out for that. Okay, so pile one, Jade. Let's get started. How do the masculines, we'll say the masculines, in your family, the males in the family view my pile one spirit. We have here Ace of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. So you or them could be an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. Okay, they see you as a truth speaker, a truth teller, somebody who is clear and concise with your communication. Okay. You might also like butterflies or winged creatures and roses. That is all of what's on this card. Okay. Oh, and they're also reminding me to do the names. Let's pull some names. Sorry, I almost forgot. Archangel Metatron is reminding me. Give me a few names, spirit. All right, they're giving me a lot for this one. So family, we have M. We have C, we have L, we have H, we have Y, and we have U. I'm not going to channel names today, guys. So go ahead and I'm seeing Louie or Chewy. Chewy right off the bat. Somebody's nickname is Chewy. They're girls and guys with, with uh, Chewy as a nickname, guys. Okay, so M, L, C, H, U, and Y. Okay. Let's see why they see this. They see you as this, okay? These are my deck. Miha, buy your own damn roses deck. They will be available for $20 on my Etsy shop. Archangel Metatron, give me two, please. Oh, and they're reminding me I don't have my singing bowl. I got um 432 hertz, though, playing in the background, guys. Okay. We have here good money, okay? So either you or them, they see you as somebody who is good with money. That's good. That's loving. It's in purple. Anything that's in purple is loving in this deck. Anything that's in blue is an omen or a warning. Loving yourself, okay? That's great. So they see you as somebody who is loving yourself also. Give me one more, Archangel Metatron. We have here more confidence. And again, this is um, loving, okay? So they can see you as somebody who may need a little bit more confidence, but it's coming from a loving place. Okay, so that's good. So the masculines in your family, pile one, this is how they see you, okay? Let's keep going. For pile two, for no, for pile one, excuse me, let's see how the coworkers or people in your community see you. Okay, we got three for that one. We have... F, O, and B, okay? So these are masculines in your community, F, O, B, Fab, Fabiola. That's a feminine's name, but F, O, and B. Let's see how these people in the community, if you're a tarot card reader, that's what we're talking about, coworkers, if you work a nine to five or any other shift, okay? Let's see, for community. Give me one, Archangel Metatron on my left-hand side. These cards wanna talk. Give me one on my left-hand side, spirit. We have here Six of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, you or them. Um, they see you as somebody who got up and left, who left to calmer water. So maybe you could have left these people at a job is what I'm hearing. Okay, maybe you're somebody that doesn't um, deal with bullshit is also what I'm hearing. Let's see. Let's use my deck. Me have buy your own damn roses. Let's see. Anything that's in blue is an omen or not so favorable. And anything that's in purple is loving or good. Mm, the devil is afraid of you. Look at that. Look at that. I'm guessing that there was like burdens and shit that happened here with these people. 
coworkers, community pile one. And the devil is afraid of you. I'm going to do um, a video soon, guys. It's going to be on um, just black magic and the shit that people are doing out here to light workers. Um, I might do it as a live. I'll let y'all know on Instagram before I do it. Um, it might be this weekend. I don't know yet. Yeah, because I know a lot of light workers right now are getting hit with shit. Give me one. Mental health issues, okay? So you or them could be getting plagued with mental health issues. And again, that's another thing I'm going to talk about too. Spirit's reminding me. I'm going to talk about that too when I do this live video. Give me one more, Archangel Metatron. Give me one more. We have here a new car. Okay, so these people see you leveling up, getting new shit, getting a new car. They could have mental health issues, though. I'm hearing bipolar, y'all. So, I don't know. Six, is, uh, six of Swords, excuse me, is somebody who is very into their thoughts, into their mind. They could be overthinking six you could be a life path six or born the sixth month the sixth house is also what i'm hearing oh for family no we're not gonna do family right now all right we're not going back there let's go to friends let's see mm, i need some water some of y'all might need some water Oh, friends, Archangel Metatron, give me one please for friends. What's going on with their friends? How do their friends view them that are masculine? We have here the lovers, okay? So they see you as a choice, an option. Um, bottom of the deck, I'm getting told two of wands. Yeah, a choice between two. I don't know what this is about because this is for friends. And then we have ace of wands next. But somebody could be either a fire sign or a Gemini here, pile one. A Gemini or a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. This could be how they see you. They could see you as somebody peaceful because these are doves. Again, with the roses. The roses are here. And also, somebody may have a dragon or be, uh, be a dragon in Chinese mythology or be into dragons. Somebody may also have a sword of a dragon. I don't know why I'm hearing that. Friends, friends, this is how they see you. They could see you as loving. They could see you as somebody that's torn between two paths also. For your friends, there's something to move around the charm. So let's get some names or initials. They could have these initials anywhere, you or them. We have T. We have J. And we have U. Okay. So let's see, how are their friends seeing them? Masculines, men that are their friends. How do their men, their men friends see them? Somebody may also be um, LGBTQ here in this pile. LGBTQ is always welcome on my channel, y'all. Okay, we have here, check yourself before you wreck yourself. Yeah, somebody, somebody here, a friend, is like always checking you maybe, or they see yourself as somebody who... Um, I'm getting Virgo energy with this. A lot of Virgos are very critical of themselves. Oh, that's another thing we're going to talk about. I already did a video on judgment. Guys, that's another thing we're going to talk about in my black, my black magic video. Give me one more spirit. You need more self-love. Yeah, so this is not coming from a loving place, guys, because this is in blue. So check yourself before you wreck yourself. This is an omen. Okay, coming from this friend with these initials in their name. You need more self-love. So this person might be even projecting onto you, pile one. That's what I'm hearing. You are a great wife. So this is how they see you. I don't know if you're married or if they're future. You know, they're saying in the future, you'll be a great wife. Oh. Okay, let's do ops. Strangers, same sex. I was going to include love here, but I'm going to do a special one for whoever you're in love with or whoever loves you, okay? They're telling me to shuffle up the deck. Let's see. Strangers, ops, same sex. Pile one. How do the masculines in your life see you? Strangers, ops. This could be same sex. You could be a masculine watching this for another masculine if you're in a romantic relationship with them. Give me one spirit, okay, right here. Okay, the sun. This person sees you as vibrant, loving, kind, joyful. Sunflowers. Somebody here can worship Oshun. 
We got butterflies again. Somebody can also be into horses. The sun, sol, I'm hearing in Espanol, sol. Um, Sunday is also what I'm hearing. Somebody might have a son. You might have a son or they might have a son. But they see you as happy, vibrant. You could be a Leo or somebody here could be a Leo for pile one. This is how your ops that are masculine see you. Same sex couples or, par or excuse me, not partners, strangers. Give me one more, please. Give me one spirit on my left hand side. For how do their strangers, same sex, see them? We have bitterness and sadness. So this doesn't go, okay? So this doesn't go. So somebody here, it could probably an op, be an op or a stranger. They see you as like you're not happy, you're bitter and sad, which is completely false. Because look at how the cards, um, they don't go. They don't go with each other. So somebody I'm hearing has a false perception of you. A masculine in this category has a soft, ooh, a soft. Ooh, hold on, let me see. Why did I say soft, spirit? Oh, they're soft. This could be them. Spirit's also telling me. Somebody here that picked pile one, you got an ops or a stranger that's just bitter and sad. And they don't like, thank you, spirit. They don't like that you are vibrant and loving and kind. You are also a light worker, pile one. They're telling me right now to pick up another deck. They also see you as having um, mental, mental strength. Maybe you're claircognizant, clairvoyant, clairgustant, clairaudience, pile one. Yeah, this, this person don't like that because they don't have any gifts is what I'm hearing for pile one. Ooh, comment down below. Let me know if this resonates. Give me a red heart for pile one because these two cards conflict. Yeah, Duria, number two. Somebody could be a life path two, a healer, nourishment, nurture. What did I just say, y'all? Spirit told me to pick up this deck. Because you're a healer. This person don't like that. You got a straight fucking hater watching you. Who's an op? Who's a stranger? Pile one. Look at that. You're a healer. You're a nourisher. And you nurture people. This person don't like it. You're also abundant is what I'm hearing. You can also do your makeup really pretty. They don't like that you're pretty. So they're doing um, makeup spells against you. Against your looks. Your, your ancestors here got your back, though. Give me one more, spirit. Give me one more. They don't like your gifts. Let's see what are your gifts. Sorceress. <laughs> I can't even make this shit up. Sorceress, rituals, powers, will. Three. Look at this. The, the cards are ascending. You're ascending. This person does not like it. I'm hearing you're very beautiful. You may look like this girl on this card. Pile one, definitely you might be an earth sign because she's covered with earth. If not, you have the support of Mother Earth, Gaia. Maybe you ground and clear daily because you know you got these fucking haters out here. Pile um, pile one. And I was hearing black magic for this, so they're definitely throwing black magic at you. And we're going to talk about it. I'm going to do a um, probably a live video on it soon. Yeah, you're a sorceress. Give me one more. Shit, give me one more spirit. <laughs> let's see you're definitely witchy pile one we have here elven touch recovery comeback revival yeah this person does not like how you keep coming back maybe they even start started throwing shit at you and you keep coming back you're an ice queen my hearing ice uh isis some of y'all rever isis but i wanted to say isa what's what's your name from frozen what's that girl's name Recovery, comeback, revival. Yeah, they, they don't like that. Maybe you cut them off or you're cold to them. This person's afraid of you, I'm hearing. I just heard it, pile one. This person's afraid of you. Give me for op spirit. Why are the ops seeing them like this? They don't like that you're happy. Oh, okay, so spirit's reminding me of this. So I have here this um, scripture. It's Exodus 14, 14, Okay. Pile one, write this down. Keep it somewhere where you can read it, okay? The Lord will fight for you. All you need to do is be still, stay happy, okay? Pile one, they are watching you to see if you're miserable and you're not. <laughs> you're not, pile one. So they're hurt, they're pressed. They're bitter and sad because you're, you're still happy. 
Also, up your protection pile one. I think these people probably threw some shit at you. Give me uh, one more, Spirit. We're going to do two more of these from my deck. Loving your body. Yeah, what I say, these people do not like that you're a healer, that you have good self-worth, confidence, ego. Your ego is healthy as well, pile one. They don't like that. These are op strangers. And if you're same sex, if you're into um, the same sex, this could be a same sex person. Or they're into the same sex. Give me one more. Ooh. Okay, so Spirit's telling me to take both of these. You are a high priestess, okay? You could be a Pisces or a Taurus. I say Taurus too. Or a new lover. You have a new lover. Spirit's telling me to take both of these and they're mad. This is why this person is um, is mad. So look, look, they have demons on them. Your demons are, their demons are coming for them. Yeah. This person's butthurt over here. If you have ops or a masculine. Okay, thank you, spirit. This is a masculine. They're mad. They don't want you to have a new lover. So this could be somebody from your past. Give me one more, spirit. Hold on. I'm going to do tarot with, with this. This is getting juicy. My pile one's lately been, been really juicy. Give me one. Who is the spirit that's hating on my pile one? Death. Could be a Scorpio. Could be a Scorpio. Also, up your protection because they don't want me to talk. I'm getting told that they could have did some shit on you. Bottom of the deck, eight of cups. Yeah, you walked away. You walked away from these people. <laughs> I'm hearing y'all say, I know. I know exactly who the fuck this is. <sighs> these weirdos out here. Oh, yeah, we're going to talk about some weirdos, too, that be in our comment section um, as readers. And what else, spirit? Oh, that try to, like, get our friendship. Thank you, spirit. Try to get our friendship and then, like, I don't know, get weird after they think that, like, we're, like, best buddies or some shit. We're going to talk about it in my Black Magic video. Okay. Love, crush, current. Oh, moderators. That's, they're telling me moderators. We're going to talk about moderators, too. I don't know what that's about. Okay, let's get some initials. They're reminding me that I didn't get initials for uh, others and strangers. So let's see who this could be. Look, who is this spirit? Give me some initials for, ooh, for this one. Okay. So you or their name could have an S, an I, a K. Another eye. Somebody has double eyes in their name or a blank space. What did I say? Some of y'all already know who this person is. Y'all already know. All right, let's do love and crush for pile one. How do the masculines who chose pile one see my pile one? Love, crush, or your current person. They're telling me to shuffle. Love, crush, or current. Think about your person, basically. I don't know. I'm hearing some of you live with your person or you used to live with your person. So some of y'all are married. Okay? Love, crush, or current. How does the love, crush, or current partner see them? Three of swords. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, like you broke their heart or they broke your heart. Somebody is into black birds or can speak to birds. Some of y'all are communicating with animals, is what I'm hearing. Okay, why do they feel like three of swords, spirit? Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, why do they feel like... There's a lot of air sign here. Why do they feel like um, somebody's heartbroken here, spirit? For their current partner or their lover or their crush. People love you. Yeah, this person... They know that other people love you. This is loving, too. It's in purple. Bottom of the deck, you are well-liked. Okay, so this is how they see you. They see that you're well-liked. Your current partner, pile one, people love you. Stella got her groove back. You're getting your groove back. Spirit's telling me to take it. <laughs> you are the shit. Spirit's also telling me to take that. I don't want to see the next one. Okay? You are the shit. I'm going to go ahead and shuffle. We got here a new contract. Look at nothing but goodness from your current partner, guys, or current crush. 
You are well liked. People love you. Stella got her groove back. You are the shit. Let's see. Let's see if that card comes out. If it comes out, it's meant to be. Archangel Metatron. What else? What else does their current partner think about them or their crush? Happiness and joy. All of these cards, y'all, are happy cards. Stella got her groove back. Happiness and joy. At the end of my deck, you get five blank cards, and this is what I put. You are well liked. You could put anything you want on them. You are the shit, and people love you. All right, Pile 1. If this resonates, please comment down below. I'm going to keep it moving to Pile pile number two black obsidian and let me know if this resonates for how the masculines or the men in your life view you and again i like separating the energy because the way your your daddy sees you is different from the way these ops see you or these online with fucking weirdos so <sighs> definitely definitely Comment down below. Give me a red heart. Let me know if this resonates. <clears throat> Y'all got to work on your throat chakra too because my throat chakra keeps wanting to close, guys. Pile one. All right, give me a second. Let me just clean this out so I could go to pile dose. They're telling me to burn some, um, some sage. Second. Archangel Michael, Archangel Gabriel, ancestors, Ama, Apa, Abuelos, y Abuelas. Please clear the energy from Pio One. Archangel Michael. Thank you. All right. Pio number two. Black Obsidian. Black Obsidian. How do the masculines see my Pio two? All right. They're telling me to shuffle my deck. I'm going to sage my cards a little bit. Archangel Metatron. Show me how the family members, the guys in the family, the masculines, this could be siblings, this could be aunts, uncles, etc. Brothers. Um, I don't know why I said aunts. So uncles. I meant to say uncles. So show me how the family sees pile two, the masculines. Okay, we have here eight of wands, Aries Leo Sag. This is about communication. This is about passion. Somebody here might also like horses. They can see that you're doing your thing online. Maybe you're an influencer or something like that. I don't know your life, y'all. But maybe you're a good communicator. Okay, let's see some initials. I'm not going to say the names. So I'm just going to dro drop the initials. You or them could have these initials anywhere. Ooh. Okay. We have here U, H, I, blank space. You know exactly who this is. And yet another you. So somebody has got a lot of U's or H's and I's in their name or you do. Okay, this is for my deck. Miha, buy your own damn roses. They will be available on my Etsy store May the 1st. Archangel Metatron, give me, give me three. Top of the deck, middle of the deck, and back of the deck, spirit. How does the family see pile two? We have here, stop playing with magic. So some of them, they know that you're a witch, a bruja. You're doing your thing online. Bitterness and sadness. They see you as bitterness and sad, or that's how they are. A hoopty car. They see you as having a hoopty car. Pile two. Poverty surrounds you, so maybe these people are a lack mentality or they see you like that. Spirit's telling me to take it. You manifest F boys and girls. They're also telling me to take that. So I don't know what's going on here. 
um, pile two, but I'm getting that these people are not very favorable as far as in your family, the masculines. Maybe you got a narcissist in your family is what I'm hearing. Oh, we, this is my family deck. My family matters deck. Give me, give me one spirit. Oh, they're telling me to shuffle. Yeah. Somebody in your family, you don't fuck with them. Your dad, maybe your dad hit you is what I'm hearing pile two. You don't get along with your dad. Maybe your dad beat you. Oh man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, pile two. That's fucked up. What's going on here? Okay. We have good P or D. Yeah. This is, this is a narcissist. Mm, some bad shit happened here for pile two. They don't want me to say. Who is the spirit? Grandma loving watch the kids. Oh, they want to tell me some tea for this pile. Aunt, uncle. What did I say? I said, I don't know why I said aunt with uncle. Spirit's telling me to take it. That's, they tell me not to, not to keep going when they do that. Give me one more spirit. Who is this? Hmm takes vacations for the gram this is definitely a fucking um they say that you take vacations for the gram pile too like if you travel a lot they say that you're always um going someplace and shit doing something and you're into black magic is also what i'm hearing give me one more spirit what is the family the masculines in the family saying about my pile too a masculine yeah we know that this is definitely a masculine, masculine energy. Thank you. If that's an ant, that's an ant with masculine energy. Thank you. They're reminding me. Brown eyes, a celebrity, 100K followers, you or them. There's definitely getting, giving me narcissist vibes. This person's obsessed with you and your family. This is weird ass vibes too. You keep people out of your business. You're private as fuck, pile two. They can't stand it. These people need to heal and do shadow work. Yeah, this is this is fucked up because they showed me somebody getting abused, guys. I'm not going to go too deep into this because, you know, it's a general reading, but somebody here definitely needs a personal reading, man. You were them. Shit. In school, accomplishing goals and dreams. Eastern star sister. Spirit told me to keep going. Short hair. Yeah, something something fucked up is going on here with your family. Your family could have been doing some shit on you too, pile uh two. <sighs> Initials. Blank space. You know who this is. I H U and U. I'm here in narcissist. They surround themselves with poverty. Maybe they're doing black magic. They're an F boy. They drive a hoopty and they're bitter and sad in your family. Wow. Wow. Spirit's telling me to move on. Hit me up if you need a personal reading. Beautifulplacetarot at gmail.com, y'all. Shit. Coworkers community. Let's see. How does the masculines that are coworkers or in their community, if they're online or whatever, see them? Ooh, they're trying to drain your energy <clears throat> is what I'm hearing. Pile... Pile two. Yeah, they're trying to drain your energy. They might be siphoning your energy from you. On my Patreon, the next video I'm going to do is about higher magic, guys. They tell me to like Palo Santo. Some of y'all, y'all are getting really sleepy. Y'all are getting really tired is what I'm hearing. That's because these motherfuckers are doing um, spell work on you. Okay, how do the masculines that are co-workers or in their community see them? We have here nine of swords. What did I say about sleeping? She's sleeping in this card, y'all. I can't even make this up. They have black birds watching you. But you're a divine feminine or divine masculine with feminine energy. Nine of Swords. They want you stuck and in your head. They want to slow you down. Pile two. You definitely need a protection. You need to up your protection too. I'm telling y'all we're going to do a, a whole talk. We're going to do a whole video on um, black magic and how motherfuckers are getting hit with shit out here. 
okay? A beautiful new home. They see that you have a beautiful new home. More confidence. They see that you have more confidence. And a new job. This is what they see. You are breaking generational curses. I'm hearing from your ancestors, from somebody's ancestor here. You, you may need to just relax. Your angels are protecting you. They're telling me to keep going. Yeah. Yeah, they want you to be stagnant, though. They want you to be stagnant. I'm not taking it. Give me some initial spirit. We got here an F, a T, a Y, a K, and a D. Your name or their name could have these initials. TD, TK, something like that. TD, I don't know. Mm. Yeah, they see you as witchy. Let's see why. What gifts do you have, Pile 2? Archangel Metatron's telling me to pick from this deck. Oh, somebody came from Pile 1 as well. Thank you, Spirit. The Elf Queen Introverted Burden Responsibility. Yeah, these people want you to be burdened. You can have blonde hair or blue eyes, or they're doing something in your crown chakra. 13, 1 plus 3 is a 4. You're introverted right now. This is why. Next, we have the Hedge Witch. Herb Wisdom Secrets Hidden Lore. Yeah, number 5. So these cards are going up now, similar to Pile 1. 4, now we have 5. You're a Hedge Witch. That's why they're doing this shit on you. You can have black hair, blue eyes. The Green Man, Initiative, Fertilization, Action. Mm. You could be an earth sign or into herb magic. You could be a kitchen, uh, a kitchen witch too is what I'm hearing. Sigil magic is also what I'm hearing. You may need sigil magic to protect you, protect you, excuse me, pile, pile two. Put my evil eye right here for these haters out here. All right, friends, masculines that are friends. Some of you got um, same sex or LGBTQ friends here. Gay, bi, boys, E, O, L, and J. You are them. Okay. Friends, these people are your friends. How do they view my pile? How do they view my pile too? Okay. We have here the star. These people are real supporters of you. They see you like you're a star, like you're healing, like you heal others. We have justice. Yeah, you have good karma coming to you. Can be a Libra or an Aquarius. Then we have King of Swords next. Okay. Justice and the star, both are major arcanas. Let's see what's going on here. How do they see my pile two, the friends of this pile two? A new contract, yeah. They see you like a star, like maybe you're making money, you're getting a new job or something. Good health, they wish you good health. This is in purple, guys. In this deck, the purple means that it's a good, a good sign, a good omen, something loving. God's chosen ones, what I say they know that you have justice coming to you, your friends. This is how your masculine friends see you. You're the star. Spirit's telling me I can stop here. You're a great wife. We could take it. Yeah, this is how they see you, your, your guy friends. Okay, let's do others, strangers, ops, or same sex in case you're in a same sex relationship. Archangel Metatron. Show me how they see, how the masculines, the males see my pile too. How ops or weirdos <laughs> see them. We have here strength. Yeah, you're very strong. I'm telling you, somebody's doing spell work here and it, it ain't affecting you. You could be a Leo or North Node, South Node Leo. Leo heavy in your chart. Oshun is also here. Give me one more. Give me one more spirit. King, no, excuse me, Knight of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. You're somebody that's fast moving. You move in and out. 
How do they see you? How do the ops, strangers, or some same sex see my pile, the masculines, see pile two? Give me one more. Okay, we have loss of money. Yeah, they may want you to lose money. Your kids will be all right. Mm, this is loving, though. Some of, you, some of them see you like you're a great wife and like your kids will be all right. Many love offers. They see you have many love offers. Give me one more, Spirit. Mental health issues. You are them. Keep in mind, this is energy. It could go back and forth. Mental health issues. Mm, let's see why they see you as strength. I want to know. Why do they see pile two as the strength card, Spirit? And then we'll go over your love and crush. If this resonates, give me a black heart in the, not in the chat. I always want to say the chat in the comments. The trickster, deceit, betrayal, guile. Yeah, this person tried to trick you. They could be a trickster with those, those initials or with these characteristics. 19 is 10. You're at the end of a hard cycle. Deceit, betrayal, guile. Yeah. Watch these ops and these strangers out here, pile two. <clears throat> Let me get some water, y'all. Excuse me. Like, share, subscribe. Oh, that's how our channels grow, guys. You got to hit that subscribe button. Don't be stingy out here with your likes and your subscribes. Go ahead and leave me a comment. You could be another reader. Go ahead and leave me a comment. Don't be a hater. There's enough hate in this world. <laughs> I'm already getting told who's watching me. <laughs> it makes me laugh. Okay, the trickster, deceit, betrayal, guile. Okay, so love, current, or crush, okay? The masculines, the males. This could be a, a feminine, you know, with masculine energy as well. They're telling me to clarify that. How does this person feel about my pile to their love their crush or their current partner we have here the hermit yeah you you might stay home a lot you might be um recuperating from psychic attacks the hermit is virgo energy you or them could be a virgo one more the hierophant yeah taurus energy what i say about recovering from psychic attacks or you're a you're a divine feminine divine masculine so that's how they see you. Somebody who's spiritually aware, organizational, structured, Taurus energy. You're like a high priest, high priestess. Give me one more. They know you're out here for the collective. The temperance, man, all major arcana. Oh my goodness. Spirit's been doing that to me a lot lately in my readings. They're giving me all major arcana, guys. The hermit, higher event, and temperance. Your fix-it angel is here. Could be a Sag, a Taurus, or a Virgo. You or them. But this is how they see you. So these could also be your North Nodes or your Risings. Keep in mind, our Rising sign is how others see us. How we present to the, the outside world. Um, give me one of these, Spirit. I want to see how they see you. And then I'm, I'm moving to the Charms. How do they see you? Um, your love, crush, or current partner? Astrid. Love, fire, sensuality, fertility, 10. Yeah, they see you as um, passionate, desirable. Maybe somebody here likes red or has red hair. You could like fairies or fall foliage is also what I'm hearing. Somebody could have green eyes or like um, dark lipstick. Give me one more at the bottom of the deck. They're telling me. Initiate, curiosity, open, warm. Somebody here definitely likes red. Y'all know that's my favorite color. Somebody definitely likes red here. Huh, you're a shapeshifter. Transformation, primal wisdom, instinct. This is how your love, your current partner, your crush sees you. You're a shapeshifter. Could be native or indigenous. Let's see their initials or your initials. Yeah, you got to get up your energy. Uh, pile three. I want to say pile three. Sorry, pile two. <clears throat> Maybe do some yoga. Okay, give me two. Okay, they're giving me more. Okay, your their names could have an I, a B, an O, a P, a W, or an S. 
Comment down below, guys. Let me know if this resonates. I am doing a Mother's Day giveaway special. All right. This will be on Patreon first. Keep in mind, pa Patreon gets these videos first and ad-free. Comment down below. I'm, I'm really interested in this one, too. Let me know if this resonated. All right, guys. Bye-bye. Get your energy up, pile, too. Definitely. Bye.